So this here is a potentiometer that I have modified to allow it to spin 360 degrees continuously. This is great because now I can use it as an absolute position encoder, it can tell me which direction it's facing without requiring constant power or memory, and also you can use it as sort of a dial that has an integrated on-off switch. Because if you recall how a potentiometer works, there are three pins, pins 1 and 3 have the maximum resistance listed, which in my case is 500 kilo ohms, and then in the middle there's a sort of wiper that rotates along to increase or decrease the resistance. So that's why a second ago when you saw me turning it, it went from 500 kilo ohms to no connectivity whatsoever, right, because we're in the dead zone, and then right back to a, a couple ohms increasing as I turn it. So to do this, all you need to do is undo these four little metal latches, they're really easy, but you just need something thin enough to jam it under there and lift it up. Separate the potentiometer from its housing, and then you'll notice in the little metal casing there's this notch that's been pressed out of it. That's actually the only thing that prevents it from spinning 360 degrees is that little notch. So the potentiometer on the inside has a little piece of plastic that'll catch that notch. So if you just grab a pair of wire cutters and cut that notch right out, then there will be nothing inhibiting it from spinning and you can spin it all the way 360 degrees. Put the potentiometer body back onto its little housing casing sort of thing there, and then push those little clamping pins back into place, ensuring that it's tight. A little dab of glue or hot glue would probably do well too here. I didn't use any here and it felt okay, but these potentiometers are a little bit fragile, and I could also tell after doing this that it was a little bit more fragile than usual, so it might it might do pretty well to have some glue or hot glue. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you found this video helpful. You have now just made a 360 degree potentiometer rotary encoder or absolute position encoder, you can use it for whatever you want. As always, if you make something interesting using this solution, I would love it if you send it to me. Please drop a like if this helped you out, and thank you so much for watching, I hope you have a wonderful day.